Welcome to Rick Riley's World, where we look at Rick's vast collection. What we got here, Rick? How you doing? Pretty good. Help, it's a 89-40-350 four-wheel drive. It was, uh, it was originally an ambulance. Uh, it left Ford as a two-wheel drive cabin chassis. It went to Lando, Florida where they put the ambulance body on. And from there, it went to, I think it was Salt Lake City, Utah. Yeah, advanced four-wheel drive system, and it was changed over to four-wheel drive. And from there, it went to Montana as an ambulance. And this company here, Rock, Rock, Rock River Repair in Iowa, they do uh, body swaps on ambulances. So they took the body, ambulance body off of this, put the cab extension on it, made the bed for it, and he built it for his father-in-law to go camping with. He went camping twice in it. Said he didn't like camping, so they put it up for sale. And I bought it and had it uh, had it shipped here. Where's that? The fuel fill? Yeah. Plug for the gooseneck trailer hitch. Uh, it's got airbag suspension under the back of it. Uh, Model 60 front end under it. Of course, 7.3 diesel. Pretty nice seats. Yeah, I mean that cab extension is pretty handy. We've had this probably for ten years anyway. How's it run? Runs fine. I mean, it's you know, it's just a straight seven three. It's not turbo or nothing. But I had a gooseneck trailer, grain trailer, and I went across the scales, grossing thirty seven thousand pounds with it. It didn't. It pulled it. Didn't like to stop it. Looks like it likes to push stuff. Yeah, push bumper. It's got plug-ins here for jumper cables and. Yeah. Didn't see much in there. It's, it's crammed in there pretty good. <laughs> but it's been a pretty good truck. Sound like it ran too bad either. Not all that noisy like those seven threes are. Yeah. Yeah. It's, you got to shut it off at the drive-through. <laughs> <laughs> Have you had it in the snow or used the four-wheel drive much? Uh. Not, I didn't want to get out in the salt and stuff. The only time I really used a four-wheel drive or I really needed it was that grain trailer you can have a field with a couple of times. Well, that's been a real interesting truck to look at. We'll see you next time. Y'all take it easy.